sucks a little bit, but I'm so happy. So Vadi, the Maine Coon that I got about four and a half months ago, she's back with her mom, her girl, and I couldn't be happier. So they were rehoming her due to her self-harm. Um, they thought that if she was in a home with somebody there 24 seven, that maybe it wouldn't be so bad. She'd cut down on it, etc. And she never did. It never got better even being in a home with me 24 seven because I'm always home. So they were checking in on her and it turned out that her girl really missed her. And when we got to talking about it, I was like, you know, I don't see the cat that y'all described to me. I don't see this Velcro cat that's like your shadow that sleeps in bed. I see a cat that's okay. Was she happy? Yeah. She didn't lack for stimulation. She loved to watch the turtle in the tank, loved to watch the tortoise, loved to watch the birds. She had all the toys and cat trees she could have wanted, but she just didn't seem as happy to me as what they had described. So we made the decision to have her see her girl. So her girl was going out to work in Yellowstone and she managed to be able to get the paperwork together. So she had the paperwork to be able to bring Vadi with her. And so I brought her out Friday to see her again and it broke my heart and I was devastated and I was crying and Liam was crying. But that cat, even when sitting in a room by herself, when we walked into her bedroom where Vadi had been placed, um, Vadi was just laying on the bed purring. She was just so happy to be back in her girl's room, surrounded by her girl's smell, that she was just laying on that bed purring. And that cat in that moment showed me that that's 100% where she needed to be. So now we know that the self-harming is very much neurological. And so they're gonna be taking the measures and probably gonna be declawing her back feet to prevent her from being able to scratch her neck open and harm herself. And within all of that emotion, the girl's mom is actually a Maine Coon breeder and she will have her first litter of kittens around Christmas. And we were surprised to find out that they have plans to give us one of the kittens for doing what we tried to do for Vadi and then realizing it wasn't best for her and then replacing her back with her girl and putting that animal first. When I got there to drop Vadi off, they surprised me with letting me know we're getting a kitten.